all right aussie new zealand canadian dollars now yesterday i said not much to do here we're just going to follow the same thing as the euro dollar this had already happened when i was doing the video i think this is a 15 minute chart correct and as the market moved up as you can see here it all came down okay all the way down here target one target two as you can see the market should come up here if it does you can sell it off not much else to do here okay but pretty obvious i talked about this level before i said the market's going to fill in this level so no surprises here i've been telling you we're going to come down here since the market's been like up here somewhere so if you kept selling on until down here you're okay you're in the you know you're all right to do so no problem now will it come further down obviously when the market is this down you've got to be careful there's still room to come down so let's check out the weekly on the weekly hcl1 is 64.58 so we've got to put that on there 64.58 <clears throat> let me do that which is pretty much there so we still have room to come down let's get rid of that okay on the weekly that's how it is on the daily as you can see we still have some levels down there 22 65 48 here as well and then we've got 65 48 64 90 64 90 is there and what else we had 64 90 65 50 65 20 65 50 and 20 as you can see the more we got levels down here the more it's going to get cramped okay so when you're selling now you got to make sure you're going to be in this range here okay so 65 20 there so we should have more room to come down but remember there are four targets in they're pretty much apart so as soon as this thing is filled in here okay the 65 50 as you can see is like pretty good if you want to sell again the only time you can do that is if it comes up to 28 today which is 6608 and that's it 6608 or up to the daily pivot where 6608 is going to be there all right so 6608 is here if it comes up here or up here at astro hours it's sellable new zealand dollar i said don't muck around with it too much still i say don't muck around with it it's done what it needs to do yesterday it was a bit boring but remember look we had these targets so the market coming back down into these levels should not surprise you we've got targets down to 24 which is 60 43 you want to follow it through sell it when it pulls up okay don't just sell it straight away we're always looking to pull up before it will sell again so the daily pivot could be a level for you there to do so right there and there's a bit of a gap here so you've got to be mindful all right so no dramas at all there you go and yesterday this zone was a pst level you can see the market couldn't really stay above that level either and at the astro hours it just fell through not much to talk about Canadian dollar, wow. I said we'd get into this zone, this black region here, and it's done so. I was a bit scared here, but the market had broken out yesterday. So I did mark in a target there. Oops. So this is the Canadian dollar. We had those targets, and then we've got that 38.88 there as well, still on the cards. As you can see, why? Let me just check out the weekly 70. 1.40 wow that is going to be out there okay if it does go up there we need to sell it again so i'm going to put it on there anyway because the pst level and unless the setup changes that's going to be valid for us 40.35 is going to be there okay so still on the cards if it pulls back into the daily zone as you can see daily pivot zone you can go long again if you want now tomorrow because there is 
news coming out the market may whip saw come back into this demand zone the weekly and then push up so be careful all right don't fall for those stuff let's take a look at nasdaq oz 200 and dax okay let's wait for the opening nasdaq astro hours coming all the way into the weekly no surprise there at all as you know right now monday was for dow jones sp500 a swing day as you can see nasdaq did the same thing and then tuesday the big fall happening now if we take a look at the daily this has got room to come down into this zone i think even lower as well so this month we should head down and if it does let's take a look at the weekly should probably come down lower because this should kind of push down back into back into where is the question 41 10 7 9 6 we should pull back into the zone here right in there okay fair enough 10 7 9 6 is about there so this is going to be back okay well let's see i'm not sure if we'll go all the way down there but this month we should pull back and it should be a good pullback month for us to then follow through okay so what do you want to do today well we're short-term traders so any pull up we want to push down we're on the weekly here so where you want to sell is probably going to be either on the weekly or um poof. around here so the opening the weekly and this is okay to sell so the opening region is not looking too bad all right and there's a bit of gap to fill there so this and the weeklies the daily pivot zone there so if the market does put pull up selling again is not a bad idea be mindful for the news i've been saying it Oz 200, nice, nice. This is a good sweep, as you can see. The market should now, well, this is nice, okay, because it's sweeped this level, and if it comes back up to go down again, it's logical. So what to expect with this is if the market comes into the daily, okay, then we should push down as well. Can you regard this as a runner? Why not? Okay, so coming back up, Coming back up to sell at Astro Hours is logical on this one, okay? There is room to fill up here, so sooner or later we're going to pop our heads back up, so be careful. That's... I gave price levels yesterday, Astro Hours, beautiful fall, as you can see, all the way into here. We should come further down, as you can see, from those targets into this zone. Um... So we'll probably head down to that 60 zone, 15 to 80. 15 to 80 is going to be down here. 15 to 80. So we should come down into these levels this month, actually. Well, I mean, maybe even closer, right? It's pretty close. It's not that far out, as you can see. So the market sizzling down is an option there, as you can see. On the daily... 45 is 15337. 15337 is there. So the market through 1533. So we should head down into this zone. Okay. So the market should come down. So if we go up, sell it down at Astro House.